Greetings, greetings, fellow nerds. Motor City Games here with a short video today with a couple of booster packs to open from the Epic Trading Card Game. Just show off the art here. Two different variances on their packaging. I don't know if you can even... There you go. The, the gods do battle while the fate of the world hangs in the balance. There you go. There's no resources or land cards, see. And this is from 2009. EpicTCG.com. Designer Robert Dougherty. There you go. $3.99. I don't think the website's still up and running, but I will check it out. And then I have one more little fun thing to open that I didn't think was real at first a pack of vax cards the game of infectious disease and fun the future expansion deck there you go collect the vaccines and battle your friends with a herd of infectious diseases targeted diseases of future vaccinations with large global impact yes core components to play vax cards are in the starter deck vaxcards.com this can't be that old if it's got a twitter and an at on it. And obviously this is pre-COVID. Well, I shouldn't say obviously there. Not for medical diagnosis or treatment. For use of learning, comma, fun, missing an Oxford comma, and promotion of safe, presentable disease practice. No period in the end. So we're going to start with the Vax cards because this just... I thought I was getting a starter deck. And I can't believe I paid... I think eight dollars for one pack of cards i feel really stupid for not paying enough attention but see it says future expansion deck so in my defense i can't believe i paid i've paid less than that for booster boxes let alone one pack but just the novelty if i can get these out i don't want to ruin this pack because people won't believe me that this is a real thing there we go Vax cards right here. This, these are real. Oh, got to smell them. Hopefully it won't give me a disease. Hmm, one, two, three, four, five, eight cards. Like a dollar a freaking card. Um, they smell like cardboard. Old cardboard. So here we go. Future disease Chagas. Chagas. Well, there we go. Seven million, ten thousand out of every seven million people, I guess will die eye swelling or heart swelling hmm well there you go next we have dengue i have heard of that dengue fever three million two hundred thousand incidents two thousand people backbreak fever or fire fever oh looks like i picked up the hiv immune system failure or replicate yeah 36 million, 700,000, 1 million. Yeah, but how many of those are in the United States? Hookworm, line and sinker. What is this? Leishmaniasis, ulcer, or mega spleen. Oof. World War superhero. Malaria. Good thing we have hydrochloroquine. And last but not least, wow, schistosomiasis, schistosomiasis, itch or egg lay. Well, that's revolting, but uh, hey, no COVID. Although something tells me they probably don't have a card for that from the Vax cards set. So on to something a little more fun than communicable diseases, the epic game oh smell test they still they smell the same as that cardboard i got them both from the same place so i'm sure they were packed together in a closet or a shelf somewhere brothers of the beast epic trading card game fireball deal three damage you would think that would be a lightning bolt hey oh epic tcg.com does it have? No, it just has 96 out of 300. It doesn't say the rarity. Is that like CGI or just... Hmm. hmm. 
coming or going. It definitely is like a PS1 style CGI plot plucker. Feeding Frenzy. See him out. Gatekeeper. Spellquake. Hunting Weaver. Oh, on top of Great Pyramid. Dark Leader. Elven Bolt Thrower. Nice. Well, that's cool. Ancient Red Dragon and Fluke Focus. Nice artwork there. Plague Bear. Oof. <laughs> it's Snoke. Elven Chariot. Kneel before me. John Romero approved artwork. It's nothing spectacular, but definitely interesting. Here we go. Got my two packs saved, and here we go. Seaside Cave. Yes. Never. Return home. That's cool. It's like a... Well, I was going to say a scene from the movie Titanic, but the clothes are not accurate. It looks like modern people trying to pretend they're on the Titanic. Kidnap. Evil natural event. Unquenchable thirst. By a time ripper. That's cool. Cherish. Guns. Lots of guns. Yeah, see? Definitely, you know, PS1 style. Cutscene graphics. Dark Prince. Uh, wearing a turtleneck with wings attached. Looks like. Claudio Castagnoli, the Lizard King. <laughs> Make a Beatles reference here later. Ha, ah, Wood Nymph. Necromancer Lord. Oh, well, yep, she's got two nose rings and lip rings. Definitely, definitely an evil magical champion. Leave me! Banish all champions. Time to go. Savior and Sage. This could be fun to play, but I, I think you just need two packs for each player to shuffle together and make a deck, and that's why I got the four packs. Cherish, guns, lots of guns, fireball, coming or going, thought plucker, feeding frenzy. So maybe each, no, honey weaver, maybe each pack has the same cards based on the picture on the cover. That would make sense to me. And it would be kind of like how Invasion does it. And the Jumpstart cards. Are, nope, that ain't the case. Because that's a sweet Hydra. That I don't have. Last. Short. Never. At home. Kidnap. Now I'm getting the same. Oh no, Scales of Justice. Break Scales of Justice. Break target. Banish. Banish. Interesting. Ooh, Bull Elephant. That's cool. Another Dark Prince. Artwork looks a little lighter. Another Lizard King. Another Wooden Oof. Another Leave Me. Well, so there you have it. Epic trading card game. And Vax cards. Two dead trading card games. And uh, But that was fun. And that was not worth eight bucks, but these were a dollar piece. So you can't pass that up. Thanks for watching, and I hope you all have a great day.